Hello, my name is Chris Wood and I'm working in collaboration with OmniTech News to bring you this review of TeamViewer 5. TeamViewer really is an amazing program. Now, if you're using it for personal use, it's absolutely free, which is the really cool part. However, if you're using it for a business, um, a lifetime li license is $689. A premium license is $1,389 and a corporate license is $2,629. Now, each of these licenses has their own special features. For example, the premium and corporate license have these cool programs like TeamViewer Manager, TeamViewer MSI Package, TeamViewer Web Connector, and TeamViewer Portable. They each have their different amount of licenses um, so you can install more than one TeamViewer program on your computers. The uh, basic license can only have one and additional licenses are 129. Um, the other two you can install it on unlimited workstations. Um, so even for a business this is, this is a really good thing. Now let's go over some of the basic sessions you can use with TeamViewer. The first type is remote support. The second, presentation. Third, file transfer. And fourth, VPN. Remote support allows you to remotely control a computer as if you're sitting right in front of it, even through firewalls. The presentation allows you to show your desktop to your, your business partner, partners or other people um, that they can't come to your your place of work or your place of residence um, and the file transfer allows you to transfer files from one computer to another without using a USB or other means. VPN allows you to set up a virtual private network. Now even though this is only using TeamViewer's personal license it still has very many features under the extras menu in options it allows you to set a display name, start with Windows, configure network settings. It allows you to set passwords, um, and it, you can make your a spontaneous access string, which uh, displays a password for your um, TeamViewer workstation for a few for a while for spontaneous access, as it says, and it and allows you to add rules to the computer. Um, you can change the quality of the remote display. Um, recording sessions and access control rules for other computers, presentation options, partner list options, which I'll show you in a second, audio options so you can talk to a friend, video options, cus um, sending an invitation um, so you can work with somebody, and more advanced options. A newer feature that TeamViewer has added to this workstation is the partner list. Now there's a button down in the bottom right hand corner that you can click and a partner list login comes up. What you can do, you just log in and you can have a list of all your computers um, that you regularly connect to. So here I have my home PC and my, my other laptop. Um, I usually have more but I, I don't have them on here right now because I was just uh, fixing it. So what I can do, I can click Home PC and click Play. And, and now you can see it's setting up a secure connection and there it is. Click OK and this is my home desktop. So what's downstairs right now um, is showing up on the screen. Now inside the remote support there's also a lot of cool features. In under extra, there's record, so you can record the session, so you can go over what you just did. Um, setting up a virtual private network, updating, um, you can transfer files. Um, so as you can see, different files you can transfer. Um, you can do audio and video chat. Um, you can change view settings, so change the quality, optimize different things. Um, and you can use control at delete, switch sides with partner, do remote boot, um, and, and other features like that. <clears throat> so, uh, very cool, it lets you do all these things. Uh, you can go to start, programs, stuff like that. Um, very, very cool. Uh, 
Yeah, and then when you're done, you just hit the X for disconnect, and it closes it and pops up the new thing. The other way connect is to get your your partner's nine number ID and a password. So you take their ID and type it right into that little box under create a session. And you click connect to partner. And you type in the password and click log on. And there you go again, another remote view of your partner's desktop. The same, mostly the same features. Now, if you want somebody to connect to your desktop so they can see your desktop, you would give them your ID under wait for a session. You give them that number and a password either pre preset or that password that they have set for you. So, TeamViewer is a really, really cool program. It, let you, it lets you do all these things absolutely free, of course, unless you're using it for your business. Um, I'll give this program definitely a 10 out of 10. It looks great. It always has, even in the previous versions. Um, I would definitely recommend getting this for any business, any person that likes to, that has multiple computers and needs to um, get files from different things. Amazing program. Um, highly recommend you use this. Um, thanks for listening to this review by Chris1056. Um, I hope to see you in the future. Bye.